And the performance without a purpose thing is, is from David's new book as well. I found that very interesting because a lot of the time people need an excuse to perform and that is what drives them forward. And you know, that's not nothing. That's an incredibly powerful, potent motivator. Yeah. If you can manage to perform without that, mm -hmm. that's real power mm. because it means that not only are you going to choose your suffering, but you're going to continue to hit close to your maximum performance mm -hmm. with no finish line, mm -hmm. no crowd celebrating your completion, right. no glory, no nothing. Uh, and that's why, you know, you carrying this fucking pointless rock <laughs> up a hill with no one there. Mm -hmm. That's why that's impressive. As I've got more mature into my training age, mm -hmm. I was prepared to push myself harder on my own mm -hmm. in the past. And now I like to train, on, train with my boys mm -hmm. and like throw down and get some metal music on all the rest right. of it. And that's fun, mm -hmm. but it has made me more fragile when it comes to training on my own. I mm -hmm. can't push myself as hard. So that's mm -hmm. something, having seen you, having spent time with Goggins, that's something that I'm gonna try and uh, reintroduce. Goggins, is, it seems like he's mastered that because he doesn't post often. He's doing it every day. You know, it is routine. You guys talked about that in detail and he's a master of <clears throat> suffering on his own. And I think that's, that's what's given him great power and influence. You're right, it's not easy.